Fitness, we are back for a very, very special episode. I am here with BBC Ski Sunday presenter, Shemi Alcott. But Shemi, why are we here? Well, we want to debunk this myth that skiers and snowboarders don't get on. So we're here to present you our full ski and snowboard, full body workout. <laughs> Just like this, yeah, get your partner and go. <laughs> go big or go home. Boom. Boom! Yes, I've had two babies. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to start with a plyometric movement, which is going to get our heart rate up and our metabolism is going to kick in. So we're going to burn fat for the whole day. We're going to do skater jumps. Super easy, super fun. We're going to try and do it in unison. You're going to balance on one leg. So really, it gets that balance engaged and then jump over to the side. So we're over to the right, left. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> left. And you can look up or you can look down and really try and hit that landing nice and soft and flex that ankle. You're aiming for 10 to 20 of these, looking for stability through the knee joint, through the feet when you land. Or you can go for a minute. After this exercise number two, we're going to focus on some of the instability with the step up and we're going to use the sofa because the sofa's soft. Yeah. Extra and challenge there. It's like when you're skiing or snowboarding and you see that there's about to be a patch of ice, you've got to be really flexible through those ankles to be able to adapt to what's happening with the snow conditions. So this is our sofa. That's what it's doing. Are you ready? Yeah, I'll just explain through at the top. Just really watch Amy at the top end. Make sure you drive that hip all the way forward. Your glutes are engaged. You've got hip stability. It's really easy to drop your hip as you do it. Make sure your hips are nice and stable. You're driving Ooh, there up we went. and holding it at the top. You're aiming for 10 on each leg. Really focusing on that drive, core engagement at the top of the lunge. And you can make it tougher by slowing down the, uh, the down movement here. Okay, power up always Woo! and then slow it down. That's where you get the eccentric strength. So exercise number three really is a full body core hit. Core is so vital, whether you're a skier or a snowboarder, and this is a fun one you can do with a partner. So Shami, if right. you'd like to lie on your back. Oh, I would love to. Okay. Yeah, fantastic. So you're gonna come forward and reach for your partner's ankles, engaging the core strong, starting out in a plank position. Shemi is then going to sit up. Okay, so it's I really type. important to get timing, right? Three, okay. two, one. Oh, and you see, we've got a beautiful box here. Okay, that's why it's called Pear's Box. You come down. Three, two, one. Ooh. Oh, well done, Amy. She picked me up there, and that was all Amy. That. You're aiming for five. And last one. And then Ooh. gently put your partner down. Boom! And then swap. So we're going to do a roll out, okay. T press up, okay? Okay. So you stand here and then you start with the core, so you're going to bend down, you're going to walk out yeah. into a really nice plank, yeah. from there you're going to do a press up all the way down and then on the top you're going to rotate and look up, follow with your eyes, one on the right, press up, one on the left and then come back and roll up, Oh. <laughs> up to the top and then down again. So let me get your core into the plank. Everything into the press up. And then that lovely rotation through the spine and the T. And then roll up. Oh, that's lovely. And how many of these are we doing, Shemi? I reckon 10 of those. 10! Loved it. That's good. That's good, that one. Never done that, actually. I really like it. Our final exercise. Shemi has called it. We know all of you back home are not a fan of the burpee, but this is not a traditional burpee. This is a burpee that is going to get you fit for skiing and snowboarding. Shemi, drop it. Yeah, totally. The burpee's awesome. It's full body. Everyone hates it because it's tough. We hate it too, but we're going to add in a lateral jump, which is really specific to skiing and snowboarding because we have all these forces pulling us left and right. So you're going to do your normal burpee, okay? Coming down, coming up, 
But when you come up, instead of coming up like this, you're gonna come across. Ooh. You're gonna come down. I like it. And then you're gonna go across. And my bum bag is all over the shop. And then cross. How many are we doing, Shannon? We're doing 10. Okay. And 10 is definitely enough. Brilliant. I'll finish off the next five for you. Go, go, she's in. So yeah, again, try and make that landing on the, on the lateral jump really soft, because then you have control, you're flexing all your joints on that. Really good. You can see we've done a big workout already because we are burning it to the end. Okay, I've got a little uh, taster for you. Okay. Skiers and snowboarders, you know, got to spice things up, grind yeah. it up. Yeah. I would say that is more ski dominant. Yeah. So I'm going to throw for the snowboarders out there and for Shemi today. Yes. We're going to do a burpee 360 for the Oh, I love it, love it. So coming down, burpee 360. Oh, wait, that was more. That was like over rotate. That was like 500. <laughs> but the key is to stomp it. So you've got to find a focus point. So for me, it's that pillar. So you're coming down, up, and stomp. Whoa! Love not that. Not stomping it today. You look like you are to me. Boom. Boom. And she just did it both ways round. Boom. Love that. Woo! Try that. Right, I'm going to have a go as the kind of Joe Bloggs doesn't know how to do it. Go on, Shem. Oh, yes, go on. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Chevy. <laughs> okay, as you can see, heart rate levels are certainly And raised. fun, super fun. Good fun, grab a friend, grab a partner, try this at home. And you know what? If you're feeling the challenge, repeat the circuit two to three times. And uh, yeah, we'll see you on the mountain. Yeah, come straight with us. Full of fitness, that is a wrap. Shemi Orcar, thank you very much for coming on to Full of Fitness. Oh, thank you for having me. Awesome fun. Make sure you like, subscribe, do all that YouTube stuff, and let me know what you want to see next week and also who you want to see.